right, I feel like I have to whisper because two people in my family are sleeping, but I've had comments that I'm too loud on here anyway, so it's probably for the best. Welcome back to our spring declutter challenge. I'm so excited for this, we're on a roll. I'm Steph, this is the Secret Slob channel, and if you are new here, welcome. We are on our way to having a clean house through daily routines, habits, and decluttering. So today, I'm gonna tackle something that is super not sentimental, but can make a huge impact in how clean one specific room in your house is the fridge. So our fridge tends to get super cluttered with like leftovers and things lost at the back, especially because we have this one where the fridge is on the bottom. You have to get really down low to get in the back there. So I'm gonna go through all of that stuff, just kind of clear it all out, clean it all out. It'll be so rewarding. It's so nice to have a clean fridge. And then I'm also gonna go through all this stuff on the top because it's become kind of a second hotspot and then we can't use this cupboard and so then we start putting things up there. I mean, it's mostly just liquor bottles, but I don't want them all out and I just want them to be like put away. It just looks kind of like untidy. So I'm gonna tackle my fridge and my freezer and get that all cleared out. It's a super easy, simple day. Everyone has a fridge. You shouldn't feel sentimental about keeping anything if it's expired or you're not eating it. I mean, see if you can pass it along or just dedicate yourself to a week of having a certain kind of salad dressing. Let's declutter our fridges right now. Okay, so I did end up having to throw some stuff away. I had some empty bottles and then some stuff that expired and some stuff that was just like, well, but I also combined a few things. Like I had two barbecue sauces and I had two soy sauces and I just like poured them together. So that's gonna save me some space. And really, I always feel guilty throwing food away, but if you clean your fridge out and if you can keep some empty space in there, a lot less stuff is going to expire because you'll be able to see exactly what you have. So do not feel guilty. This is not an exercise in guilt. Just get rid of that stuff. It's okay if it expired, it's okay if it's moldy. It's not a big deal. We'll just start fresh with a nice clean fridge and you'll be able to see exactly what you have. Okay, I'm gonna reload all my stuff back in here and then I'm probably gonna go grocery shopping. <laughs> So much better. Not really worried we're gonna run out of frozen fruit anytime soon.
So up here is the perfect example of rule number one. Don't declutter other people's stuff. So this is actually all my husband's stuff. I thought it was just kind of junk, but he's very tall. So this is a very reasonable shelf for him to be using. Obviously it's still in the way of the cupboard. So I kind of talked to him and said, what do you want me to do? And he said, well, I just really need a place to keep stuff that the kids don't touch. So fair enough. Until we get all of our storage and stuff built in this house, he can use this, but I am gonna just move it. I said, well, I'm gonna move it, put away anything that can be put away, put these bottles in the cupboard, and then I'll just put everything back. It's not ideal, but it's what's working for him, and I don't wanna be like, you can't keep your stuff here. It's his house too, you know? So just try to clean it up a little bit, because that's allowed, but I'm not gonna declutter it because it's really just not my stuff. Oh, and this, this little essential. <laughs> Classic dad. All right, that's it. Fridge, freezer, above, that top shelf. It's all decluttered. Everything has found its home. It just looks so much better. I love putting the fridge and freezer declutter near the beginning of my whole house declutter challenge because none of this stuff is really sentimental and it's huge bang for your decluttering buck. I'm gonna be so happy looking in my nice clean fridge, especially after I go get groceries and there's space for all of them. It's just a really easy place to start flexing those decluttering muscles. So I hope you get after your fridge and freezer and any kind of spaces associated with them today let me know in the comments if you did and also don't forget to subscribe and everybody that leaves a comment will be entered to win a $100 gift card to a local store in your area it's just a little bit of extra motivation from me to get you going and decluttering this spring all right I will see you tomorrow bye bye